Peekaboo Mom, we're going to be talking about songs and their uses. And I have a couple of songs to teach you, a couple of ways that we use songs in my family, and hopefully um, you'll get something great out of it. The first um, way that I like to use songs is for distraction. So this song actually comes from my mother-in-law, and it's a great one to use if you're online at the grocery store or somewhere at the doctor's office where you need to have your kid's attention. And it goes like this. Green alligators and long neck geese Humpty back camels and some chimpanzees, cats and rats and elephants. But as sure as you're born, you're never gonna see a unicorn. And the kids just love that. Another way we like to use songs is with creativity. So we like to change up words to songs or make up songs. One you could use is Elmo's World. So, la 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 la, la 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 la, mommy's world. La 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 la, la 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 la, mommy's world. Mommy loves Riley and Connor too. Mommy loves Deb, Deb and Daddy too. That's mommy's world. That's an example. You choose what songs you like and adapt them. Also, um, you can make up songs. So a song could be um, uh, Molly, Molly Muffin. I love you so much. I love you, I really do. I love you so much. And you can imagine the kids' self-confidence and feelings and how proud they are of themselves. And that's a way that um, we like to build confidence as well as through making up specific songs. My mother, for example, has a song for each of the children and they love them. The cousins want to hear the cousin's songs. They wanted her to make up a song for me. It's just, it's a very sweet way to give them um, pride in who they are. Another way to use songs is just to pass the time and you can use songs or even um, little games or mnemonics. So for this one, I'm going to use a doll um, for an example, but um, you can do it with your child, and it's called Round Round. So it goes round, round, little ball, comb Dolly's hair, one slice, two slice, tickle under there, and the children crack up. And this is great for every age. Um, my babies like it, and my two-year-old likes it when I do it to her. My four-year-old wants to do it to me, so mommy's hand, and they do it, and then you laugh, and it's just a great way of interacting and passing the time. Again, if you're in a doctor's office or an airport, it's a great way to pass the time. Another way that we like to use um, songs is for comfort and consistency. So one of the things that I've incorporated into our bedtime routine is music, and you can use it and it's great because if you forget their doll or you're visiting a relative and they're not in their own environment, it can really give them comfort um, by having that consistency from your routine over time. Also, you don't need anything. So if they're tired and they want to take a nap somewhere, you have that song with you at all times. I personally like to sing the Alleluia to the kids. You could use Twinkle Twinkle or whatever song appeals to you. And it doesn't so much matter as long as it's the same. So just, um, again, distraction, creativity, building self-confidence, passing the time, comfort and consistency, all ways that we like to use music. And this doesn't even scratch the surface of real music, CDs, um, everything, you know, from Mozart to the Wiggles. You know that music is just a wonderful um, thing for your children, and I would actually love to hear ways that you use music in your family um, that we could share as well. So you could uh, let me know that at mom at peekabooMom.com, and for more tips and um, recipes, you can check out peekabooMom.com.